Hey everyone, uh, we are playing Spark City Surveillance, and uh, this is Chris Hinkey's deck from Worlds that he played in the uh, King of Servers tournament. And I saw it on the stream, and I thought it was just the bee's knees. And so we're testing it out, and we're up against uh, Noise. Um, I'm not sure what we should do here. Probably mulligan this hand. Two agendas. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's better, right? That's better. All right. So uh, I think the play here is um, we're gonna put out our pad, and uh, we're gonna put out uh, this product placement, which is just so good. I think we'll put it. Uh, where do we want to discourage them from running? Um, HQ, I guess. So let's put it on HQ, and then we'll click for a credit. So uh, what we want to do is res this on our turn, or rather on their turn, I guess, because uh, Jinteki just ends the turn as soon as you click end turn. That's fine. And uh, get them to run here. The product placement can keep them from trashing it. Um, got a wild side. And a data sucker. Okay, that's fine. So let's see. I think we want to draw first. It's pretty cool. Hmm. Five credits. Let's try some sneaky stuff. Let's go server one. Oops, not server one, sorry. Uh, my bad. Uh, let's play this new remote, rather. Let's put this. Wait. Draw, install. Should we just throw the ash there? I think we gotta just throw the ash in the server too. And uh, yeah, should be okay. Gonna be able to control some control some uh, credits here. Noise usually can get pretty uh, pretty rich pretty fast, but um, haven't seen don't see wild side. Uh, all right. So we'll see if he wants to uh, trash the ash here and go broke. Yeah, I don't know if you trash the ash here, but I guess you could go go to zero. I wouldn't. Uh, really all right yeah i think that's okay i think the big problem here is that you know napd is incredibly hard to trash early on okay data sucker data sucker it's fine all right well we're just going to start pushing some stuff so server two new remote do you want new remote Yeah, new remote. And let's advance this once. So. Okay, so we can always res the product placement after a click to make them lose a credit, which is pretty awesome. Um, it's difficult for them to steal an NAPD contract, I think, on this board. Zero credits. No ace ops yet. Uh, what did we lose here? We haven't lost anything, just some advertisements, so toll booth, and no special offer. Ash, yeah. It's all pretty good. I really want to get this thing going, though, to... Okay. Uh, yeah, I will gain a credit. And uh, see the NAPD? Yeah, I don't know about that. That doesn't seem like a very smart run. I think right here... You should suspect this is an NAPD. I wouldn't. I wouldn't advance this behind a pop up if it wasn't. Um, how does this? When the runner's turn begins, give the runner one tag unless he or she pays one credit. It's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, we can do this. We can score all this, and uh, and we'll res this. Boom.
this is uh, really just the sweetest, sweetest flavor card for this deck. And I just think it's awesome. Perfect for for uh, what the deck is trying to do. Pays one. All right. It's going to be super frustrating because I can res this product placement. Okay. I'm going to go try to trash it. Go broke. Yeah, I will make him lose one. It's okay, he can go broke. It's fine with me. Gonna score another NAPD maybe. <laughs> Let's see. So we can pop-up window. Do we want a pop-up window? We probably want to put this over R&D, right? Because it's likely that this uh, player is going to start running R&D. I think we gotta, we're got we going to put this out and we can't advance it. So let's put this in a new remote. And let's put this over HQ. Or the new remote. Let's put it over the new remote. And let's res this not now. We're good with that. Okay. Sorry, we had a little bit of an interruption there. Um, I am back. And our uh, opponent is thinking about what to do here. This is uh, kind of a miserable noise board. Okay, we got a clone chip. That's better. That's something. Uh, we are going to res this pad campaign, aren't we? No, we're not going to. We cannot do that. So we'll just wait. Um, I actually don't mind putting city surveillance here and clicking for credits. That would be actually really, really good. Oh, can we even do that? Let's see. Go to four. You can go install, advance, credit. Nah. Let's see. Let's draw first. Let's, yeah, let's install this behind. Uh, new remote, new remote. Let's get another credit. Um, and we will res this on... Well, we'll see. We'll hold on right now. We don't really know what's going to happen here. We want to keep them off of three credits so they keep, so uh, Noise can't play Wild Side or Pancakes. Let's do that now. Okay, we'll gain two. That seems good. Um, okay, let's draw. All right, that seems awesome. I think we're actually just going to... What are we gonna do here? Server to draw. Okay. What do we want here? What don't we want here? Uh, scoring the NAPD seems pretty good but I kind of want this ice, don't we? I'm going to toss the NAPD, I think. I don't know if that's correct. I think maybe we want to be more aggressive and just score the NAPD as fast as possible. Uh, breaking news. Not really worried at this point whether he steals it or not. So, getting around on archives, four credits out there. Um, yeah, I think we'll we'll shuffle back. I think that's okay. We'll get um, Adonis NAPD special offer. Yeah, and 
go ahead and access. I think we're going to put down the launch campaign. We're going to put down the reversed accounts and maybe the turnpike this next turn, probably over the city surveillance. Alternately, uh, we could put the turnpike here, click for two credits and have two to res the turnpike. Faust, okay. That is fine. Um, hmm. I have a feeling we really need to get this money going though. Let's put that there. Let's put the turnpike over. Hmm. Let's leave the turnpike in hand. What do we want? Does he think this is our scoring remote? Maybe. All right, let's put out the reversed accounts. Could just advance it. It's kind of nasty, but I don't think we want to do that. Let's get a credit so we can res the special offer and the city surveillance. And we will res the city surveillance. Now this deck plays like a very, very slow, controlly shell game kind of deck. It's it's definitely different than anything I've played lately. What's our opponent gonna do here? Gonna gain some money, and he's going to trash clot. Okay, so no fast advance for us, and no run. So actually, we can uh, res our launch campaign, start the turn. Um, going up the four credits. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. A resistor seems okay, although Faust is somewhat annoying. Um, we really need to get this toll booth online. Um, I'd like to. I'd like him to run R and D. That would be nice. Hmm. Let's put Turnpike over Server Five, and let's advance. Let's gain a credit and advance this. So we can force him to come here and pay three, or we're gonna make him lose four. Both seem good from our perspective, I think. The question is, uh, can we withstand the noise mill fest? Noise does need money in order to get his whole rig online and we do need to find some agendas before we uh, just outright lose to mill. Okay. It's going to trash it. I think that is totally, totally reasonable. Okay. So reversed accounts did what it was supposed to do. Seems seems just fine. He doesn't want to run HQ. Product placement is uh, doing some serious work here. All seeing eye. That's that's going to be handy, I think. Um, let's uh, install this over R and D. Actually, you know what? I think we're going to want to put it here over pop up. It's possible that might be more what we want to do. Hmm. Data suckers are threatening to really hurt us here. This is a tricky deck. It is a tricky, tricky deck. Um, what have we got? Hmm. Hmm. 
Let's put it over server two. Let's put the resistor. Actually, let's uh, put out reverse accounts. Let's uh, scan a buck. So hand is fine. Hand is very well protected. Product placement does a lot of work here. Uh, special offer will get us in the money and he still has to pay one every single turn. It's pretty brutal. Okay, I'm gonna get a bunch of money here. It's great. Uh, let's draw. There's an NAPD. That's perfect. Let's put that in server two. Uh, let's put, uh, just advance it, I guess. Let's just advance it. Not really worried here. We can, we have enough uh, to res the toll booth and score the NAPD. He's got his wild side online, um, but it just has no money. So, man, this deck is just, it's just really awesome. I just love city surveillance. It costs five tra uh, to res, three to trash. So it is kind of a liability at times, but right now, just so brutal. Um, all seeing eye. Okay, another one of those. That's fine. I think we just want to score this guy. So we're at four. He's at zero. Uh, we can reverse his accounts next turn, but every single turn, losing one. So, okay, there's daily casts. That's, that's going to do some work. But look how, wow, just look how slow this economy has become. Just due to this card and and our spark ability. It's really quite, quite awesome. Parasite is trashed, okay. So there's an Astro. Um, what we want to do here is put this in a new remote. Put this in server two. We want to res uh, advance this. I think so. So take a uh, pay one. Okay. So there's ASOPs. So run here is not feasible at the moment. He would have to run central um, and then run a remote. He would have to run central twice in order to get enough. Uh, what's going on? Trashing cash. Two, three, four. OK, just trashing cash. I'm just going to res this now. Yeah, now he's at two. So we can get our Astro going and then basically we just need to dodge a uh, clock for a turn. And we have our reverse, reversed accounts, so. Okay, start. Uh, yeah, we are just going to score this out. How about that? Okay, we're at six, opponent's at zero. Well, um, I gotta say, this deck is pretty damn brutal. Pretty brutal. I'm enjoying it, I'm enjoying it. So breaking news, uh, he's got clot threat, so we just can't score the breaking news. Um, actually, we can, if we go install advance and ask him for whether he's going to, um, ooh, this is interesting. I'm going to trash it. He's gonna, I see. Yeah, let's res this guy. Who's one? He can, he can break it with two cards or a data sucker in one card. 
but really it's just done so much work, city surveillance. All right. So actually our plan next turn is going to be, we are going to reverse accounts, uh, install, advance, and use our Astro token to score. So we will be able to fast advance, uh, basically, ooh, never mind. We just win because he played adjusted chronotype. That also works. Um, <laughs> all right, so you remote. And that's game. Yeah, so um, I really am liking this Spark deck. It's uh, really, really cleverly designed. There's just a lot of advertisements. I don't know how I feel about All-Seeing Eye. I guess in the uh, DLR Val me uh, meta, it's very good. But um, overall, just the deck feels like fun to play. Highly recommend it. And we'll try it a couple more times. And uh, thanks, everybody. Thanks for watching.